We're going to talk about another big story. So Tammy is now a hurricane. So that's a big change in what we were talking about yesterday. Has there been any change in the path, Tony? Yeah, not really. We still think it's going to go over the northern Windward Islands. We knew it would be a hurricane, but it's a little mm -hmm. bit quicker, Michelle, than okay. we thought. So that's why there's hurricane warnings now up across the Windward Islands. I'm going to break those down for you here. We do get a, a, a new update here very shortly. And you can see it's moving west-northwest there at about 7 miles an hour. Winds at the 2 o'clock uh, intermediate advisory there uh, coming in at about uh, 75 uh, miles an hour. So there you have it. That's what's going on there. Now, official forecast does turn this to the northeast. The front that's coming in uh, to central Florida this weekend is going to steer this one away from the United States. But... You can see uh, becoming a 90 mile an hour hurricane here and you can see the models very good agreement now uh, central northern uh, windward isles here east of san juan but close enough to san juan uh, that we're going to have to watch that heavy rainfall potential as it's going by uh, just to these hurricane warnings now for guadalupe uh, tropical storm warnings will likely be upgraded here in saint martin to hurricane warnings this evening and you can see barbados all the way down to the south there uh, with a hurricane excuse me tropical storm watches again the intensity forecast been steady as she goes that's not changing looks like this is going to stay a hurricane right through the middle of next week we we have a lot of weekend events going on and a very good looking forecast. I'll break it all down for you straight ahead.